สวัสดีครับ Hello everybody Welcome to Endoscopy 101 This is episode 18 Today I'm gonna talk about water insufflation and I'm Dr. s u p a k i t k o m v i l a i from Surgical Endoscopy s u l a l o n g k o n Hospital Bangkok Thailand Have you ever experienced in this situation bowel contraction and fluid that remain in the colon if combined together is the nightmare for endoscopies When we found lesion and colonic lumen are not fully distended, as endoscopists, first thing we do is to i n s u f f l a t e the air to distend lumen. But sometimes we have the problem with the bowel contraction, even with the antispasmodic agent such as the buscopan, are already given to the patient, especially in some part like sigmoid colon, which have narrow lumen. With air i n s u f f l a t i o n air can go everywhere in the lumen, so sometimes cannot make wall distension, and the problem still exists. But with water i n s u f f l a t i o n water stay in only one part of the lumen, and we can solve this problem with the water. So if you face the problem with bowel contraction or difficult to distend lumen, just put water in, and you will see. I learned this technique from my colleague, Dr. Sukit or Dr. Ben Endoscopy. He also have video case report in GIE. Please check it out. This is the example. In sigmoid colon, there are contraction even with buscopan already given to the patient. You will see that the lot of the contraction still going on, and uh, some of the fluid remain inside. One polyp was hidden, so I put the water into the lumen, and you will see the result. If the preparation is not good, you can suction and put more water as the exchange to make the water clear. Lumen can fully distend e d with the water, and under water, you can observe superficial structure clear, because we can use water as another lens. To see easier than the air. When we switch to the NBI, and this is night type 2 I will do EMR for this lesion, and close by endoscopic clip. So please tie the water in s u f f l a t i o n and you will gonna love it. Please see more interesting episode all about endoscopy practice in Endoscopy 101 series in my YouTube channel. So please subscribe, set notification for any update alert for you. Thank you for watching. Please stay safe and have a nice day.